www.newtoboss.com. My name is Ty. This video is still a part of the video tutorial series I'm creating for an Encore Ethernet broadband router, a CDR King retailed uh, wired router. I'm on a part that I'm going to show you and how you can disable the DHCP uh, function of your Encore router. Probably um, you just want to make your router function as a switch or a hub. So what you do is you bring up your uh, Firefox, or as I was saying, any browser that you have in there. Type in 192.168.10.1. That's the default gateway of the router. If you might have changed that, you could use that either 0 0.1 or 1.1. .1. Uh, in case you can't access uh, this page right here, uh, it should actually give you a page that says username and password asking you to authenticate so that you can log into the router page itself. But again, if you can't access the page right here or you, you've tried several IP addresses but it's not really pulling up any page, we have a separate tutorial for that on our YouTube channel. You can just have a look at that. Then from there, you can go back to this part and then reconfigure so the default username actually is admin and password is one two three four and sometimes admin password blank click on ok but uh here it's let me go back a little bit 192.168.10.1 there you go but in my case i've changed it already so i'm gonna uh, use my username and password that should log me in and what you're going to do from here is again disable the DHCP or dynamic host configuration protocol of the router that's the one that's sending out uh, automatic IP addresses on the devices connected to a wired router let's say you have four devices then it's going to divide that 192.168. Uh, 10.1 for the first, 192.168.10.2 for the second PC, .10.3, .10.4, something like that. So if you release that or disable that, then it would not send out any IP, but then it's going to be a bypass. From a bypass mode, you can make that as a switch. So from here, what you do, click on LAN right here on top, and the, the options right there, just on top. If you click LAN, sorry, let me click back because it's not responding. Oop. There you go. And let me refresh. <laughs> Why is that sending out an HTML page? Okay, and from here, um, you got LAN settings. LAN is uh, here, and you got DHCP client list right here. So what you do, just go back to LAN settings. You got something that says the gateway acts as a DHCP server. So from there, you just have simply uncheck enabled. So you can disable that and click on OK. I'm not going to click on OK because if I do, I would be released from the IP address and I can't access the router anymore. So again, after you do that, just click on OK. That would save that back. So from there, you can make changes as to however you'd want to do with your device and with the reason why you'd want to change that or disable the DHCP. For other video tutorials regarding an Encore or some other routers that we have, do check us out at www.nudaboss.com and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash